everybody, Orphan here. Welcome back to Splatoon 3. What is... Oh, Recon. Last time, we beat the game in honestly kind of an anticlimactic ending, I will say that very much. I felt like the ending was not anticlimactic. By the way, we saved the world and the great Zapfish is back up there in the tower. This time, we are jumping back in Alternia because, as usual, with Splatoon games, there's t I would expect there to be some stuff changed in the post game. There's this new kettle that they unlocked. Agent 3, Agent 3. I also would assume that the final boss dialogue is different like the previous games. I'm so glad you're okay. I mean, I knew you would be. Nicely done. Saw, so, daring the bravery of the incredible skills. Who knew Small Fry could do all that? And you were there too. Agent 3, basically save the planet. Anyone other than us even realize that? Being here, well, it's a real trip. A boy, if you Some kind of tour where you go places. But yeah. <laughs> well, well said, Graham. So, Cap is full of praise for you too. There's a heartfelt nod of approval. You're here. Well, until next time, stay fresh! You'll be plenty of sardine upgraded gear, okay. Okay, so your dialogue isn't really changing. We would join this new Squid Beak Platoon. Can you know that Green Gig is small for an upgrade too? Doesn't your little buddy deserve it? I see I have a little buddy with you throughout all that. Oh, good night. Still look out something for the look never lies. Still can't believe Octavio turned out to be not so bad, that rascal. What do you like to eat these days, kiddo? Food? Are kids still eating food? Oh, I wouldn't get for a fresh cabbie cake now. Oh, sleeping? That was just tactical eyeball listening. See? Uh-huh. This day's lunch was mighty tasty. Maybe I should have brushed my teeth a bit more carefully. How can I help you? Do you need a pearl wisdom? Still not sure how they sun trapped me while I was underground. Yes, he's on. Okay. He's losing. Cool. So. How do I. It's gotta be a way to, like, redo the final boss, right? Because that's, like, typically a thing. But how do I launch my. Are you not allowed to launch it? Or is the secret kettle over there the final boss? Uh. Like, am I allowed to? Hold on. Altar to reach the goal. Okay, hold on. That's not. Okay. Give me one moment. into this, I actually do not believe there's any new dialogue for replaying the final boss, which is a shame, because they normally have it, uh, they normally have that for the previous Splatoon games, but I don't think there is any this time after researching it. However, I believe if we go back to the boss fights against Deep Cut, Fry hasn't learned her lesson. Yep, these have different dialogue. These have new dialogue for replaying them. About time, sheets. <coughs> Hell, no problem, See, when I get beat, I just can't let it go. Oh, that's right, almost forgot. You and me, we got deadly dance moves. Heels, get back out here. Yes, yes, yes! Rematch, baby! Yep, they actually have new dialogue. I don't believe the final boss does, but they do. Deep Cut does. <sighs> Mix it up, okay. First damn, seal down for. Don't 
me. Okay, yep, that's how I do this again. Here's I can heal. I'll fly back. Okay. Make the wheel squeal! Ah, oh, the cannon's fired up, okay. Alright, alright, not bad. You ready to feel the pain? Now watch this! Alright, here we go. Next phase. Second dance, more a whirlpool. Looks the same as the first. Kind of. It's full of the pig. Come here. He threw my bounce off. Cool. Easy. Uh, you think you treat my heels like shrimp or wrong? I get with wake us up. Fire it up, Mori power. Good luck. Final dance, Gray Mori transformation. Whoa, okay. Almost there. <sighs> You're way stronger than you look. We haven't heard the last of Deep Cut. Bet you'll miss me, ha! First rematch. New record. And now we have the rematch against Shiver. Let's see what new dialogue there is this time. Hell to the Megalodon! Psh, that catcher is using more Great Agent 3. Shark Cage! You're back! Which all I mean you missed me! How sweet are you coming all the way just to give me a win? Ah, the cold shoulder again. You are more wicked with every battle. And that's supposed to be my thing. Now listen, Master Mega. Cold water bandit shiver. Pedals of the Megalodon again. There she goes. Share with the Master Mega. I gotta get the turf because I. Easy. You're pretty tough for an appetizer. Master, I need you to really focus this time, okay? 
Ah, boy, Master Mega, let's finish this! There's a real snow start now, uh huh? I'm just getting the perfect so I get places to move. So talented, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm getting the rabbit. Well, that's done. Second phase done. Ah, come on. What is with you? Master, you better get serious or else. Yeah, that's more like it. I'm gonna show you our real power. Battle, and I mean this time to the Megalodon. <coughs> Ow. Okay, I was not paying attention very well there. Okay. Make sure I have the room to maneuver. That was a small practice. Stop embarrassing the master, and she make a look dumb. I think that's enough of a lesson for today. But you haven't seen the last of Deep Cut. So next time, uh oh no. <laughs> the launch pad. Duh. And finally, time for the best fight <laughs> against Big Man. Oh boy. That's what the captain's saying anyway. You're back! You really ought to fight me again, really? Still not a big fan of fighting, but... The other two will yell at me if I run away. Mario Sunshine Boss, round two. Check out my sweet moves. Shadow splitting up. There we go. He gets with me at the real me. Oh, you're pretty good. But I won't lose. I'm training too hard to lose. break every single one of them, but now I realize, oh, he's specifically splitting up into one. You got moves, it's true. I got, uh, more moves. He said that last time. They don't have that much. No more kick club. It's big man time. I don't have that much different dialogue. Uh, 
I'm feeling the dealers, okay? because I figured out what was going on. Uh, and there's the rematch is done. Grab the engine again. Okay, uh, I'm not feeling this story mode compared to the first one, which is... Uh, compared to the Splatoon 1 and 2, again, I'm not healing as much. Uh, anyways, let's check out that extra level that was unlocked. And this will be the end of this part once we beat this level. After all, turning your weeks ago, I gain access to the blank box, the final one. Three hundred, three thousand three hundred thirty-three for the hero gear. Entry fee is our reward. Entry fee three 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 three. I get it now because it's platoon three, and Orca isn't saying anything. Okay, let's get this thing started. Whoa, watch your step. Okay. Oh. Keep watching your step, I guess. Whoa, yeah, I climb all this. Whoa, okay. Jump when we're freaking slow like that because we need to have the armor off to become slow. Uh, uh, and of course, I was too slow to make jump loops. And when of course I realized that, I was like, ah, please jump back. It's like, no. Uh, hey, I. Problem there. Oh shoot. Oh, um. Okay. Come on.
can't do this. Uh, uh. Oh. Squid jump, right. I kind of forgot about squid jump. Okay. Yeah, squid search. Yeah, I completely forgot about squid search. So my brain was like, what? Uh, that took way too long to relax. Squid search is just a mechanic. I don't use that often. Oh, man. Ow, oops. There we go. Up we go again. Climb this freaking tower. Ow, ow. Just wait for it. Oops. Come on. Got it. Got his eggs, whatever. Up we go. Okay. Okay, that's what the game wants from me. Whoa! Oh. We have an itch. Oh. Okay. I see. That's what. Oh, okay. Alright, I'm back. 
Do not attempt to squid jump to that. Just fucking hang on to it. Okay, I get it. Fuck. Okay. <laughs> I am not in the right mindset to be doing a level like this. I need I need to take a break and like come back when I'm in the right headset for this. When I'm in the right brain space for this, I just ah. Oh. <gasps> All right, I'm back. As you can tell, it's been over a day. You can tell because my hair is now purple. <laughs> yeah, I went and got my hair dyed. Uh, I've been meaning to do that for a long time because last time I had it dyed was purple was um, back when I started this channel way back before I used face cam and then by the time I did use face cam uh, the dye had uh, uh, been washed out by that point pretty much now it's purple again <laughs> but yeah back to doing this level uh, I also wrote down when the Splatfest is so there's that so yeah, so for me it's been a while since doing this level, oh boy. For you guys, obviously it will have been a very short just skip. So I'll cut back to where the, I got the furthest in this level, which was those moving platforms, if I remember correctly. Seriously? Alright, back here with one life. Oh, this sucks. Like, oh boy.
It does save ink. I do spray on there, so I am just. This might just be the smart play to cover what I can before. There's a checkpoint here. See how long it takes us to a checkpoint, please! Holy crap, to a checkpoint, please! Checkpoint! Oh, it seems like it is a checkpoint. I'd pop all these targets on, huh? okay. Oh, thank god. I made that first part. God, it's frustrating. Jeez! Got that section at the end. I'm so oh my god. Don't 
Chong, chong, chong. No! Ah! Still balloons. Come on. Oh, barely. That was so intense. Yeah, almost didn't make that last one. Great job. You're not done yet, but keep it up. Oh, oh my god, that balloon popping section. Jesus. Oh, okay. Ah, sucker block. You probably don't need an explanation what those do by now. Right. I Okay. 
Okay, so far, this isn't too bad. Oh. I see. against time. I thought it would go right below me, which is why I did the damn it, I jumped the gun. Oops. Okay, uh. at least I know that this one's gonna be a race against time. At least I know it's gonna be a race because I know where I have to jump now. Slow, fuck! Because I have damage to my armor and it slows you down. Fuck! Checkpoint. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Okay, now our checkpoint. Oh, Please. oh God. God. It just keeps going, going, going. Alright. Okay, so far so good. Jump on that, good. Good. And the stage would be 
the last stop, but I guess that's obvious, huh? Stop, so close. Oh, I see, okay. No, 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 no. No, oh, fuck. Fuck. No! Oh, you can't reach it with your weapon. You have to throw a small fry. Don't think I realized a little too late. Okay. And then of course I fucking miss both throws. Uh Okay. Stressful. I swear I got to move on. Oh my god. This level just keeps going and going. Okay, time for fights. Okay, time to actually fight. We haven't actually really do that in the level. Can I go back there? Like, way back there? Okay, probably time for our carrying fights. Enemies incoming! Yep. Don't fall out, don't. Whoa! Frickin' blaster! Get on. Get off! Get off! Get off! Get off! Get away. Three enemies left. Get off! Alright, where's the rest? Was that all of them? I think that was all of them. Yeah, I'm ready for it to not be all of them. Can't special. There are more of them. 
up and I need to figure out where they are. It's not cleared up! Like an auto bomb! Good, who's next? I'm just gonna ink as much turf as possible if I don't know where they are. So yeah, if I don't know where they are, then inking as much turf as possible. That was the last one, right? Probably not. There's even more of them? Okay. Oh, right! Crab tank is not... Uh, crab tank is not to use, right? Uh. I had more enemies time. That's not my bomb. Oh, you've got him, kid. Uh.
That's what's so fucking thinking. Ridiculous. That was fucking ridiculous. Holy shit. That was goddamn ridiculous. <sighs> that is every single level in the game beaten. Alternian world champ with every single uh, thing. Teddy band. Huh, that makes sense. <sighs> with every single weapon in the game. Holy crap. My god. Jeez, that was ridiculous. That was ridiculous. Whatever, we got that and we got the final log. 
Look, number seven, return the mammalians. Recall for a moment the first apocalypse that devastated the human race. Those who escaped into the caverns of Alternia were not the sole survivors. There were others who escaped via a giant rocket ship, the Ark Polaris, launched in nick of time. This ship was laden with many of our species that had been placed in cold sleep. The ship was simple. Find our plan to replace the Earth. During the circumstance of its launch, the Polaris had a smooth voice. Till it reached the edge of the solar system. It was at that point that debris struck the vessel, damaging its navigation system. The crew was able to turn the ship around head back toward Earth. But the effort was in vain. Uh, vain. There was not enough fuel to attempt a landing. Our Polaris drifted aimlessly for 10,000 years. Eons passed. The once stable orbit of the Polaris decayed over time. Until the ship found itself in the inescapable pull of the Earth's gravity. Ranger was not kind to it snap its all pairs save one, bear number three. An experimental subject who had retained consciousness within its cold, his cold hibernation survived. For 12,000 years he had dreamed and plotted. Fully awakened, bear number three came to a terrible realization. He had not landed on a new planet at all. He's back on Earth, and yet it was not the Earth he knew. The Earth it seems dominated by secret. There's not a single mammal to be found. In the course of his search for even a single fellow mammal, Bear 3 used navigational equipment from the records of the Arc Polaris to discover Alternia. It was a wasteland, of course, but few of the liquid crystals that once covered the walls and ceiling remained. With knowledge built during his thousand years of dreaming, he repaired some of Alternia's facilities and began researching the crystals. The research bore fruit when Bear Number 3 compounded some of the liquid crystals with his own fur. The experiment created an entirely new substance with one terrifying property. It could transform any living creature into a mammal. Bear number three realized the implications immediately. He could restore a plant to a mammalian paradise. He began stockpiling fuzzy ooze, as he called it, with an alternative still intact rocket. For such a venture, he acquired the acquisition of thousands of golden eggs. These were used in the creation of the fuzzy ooze. Ah! Although the exact details have never been recorded in my memory banks, but bear number three had a plan. He founded a corporation that would go out on to employ locals to collect the golden eggs other than in Grisco Industries. With degrees, as he was now known, it would pay handsomely for them. With fuzzy use production peakling, thanks to the assistance of unexpected unsuspecting gillings and octolings, Mythicers took the final steps to set his plan to motion. The rocket was loaded. It wouldn't be long now. Ooh. That's interesting and fascinating. <laughs> okay, that definitely puts a lot more perspective on the end of the game with its final with the final boss and everything. Oh my god. Anyways That's gonna be it for now. Next time on Splatoon. We well, first of all, I have badges. Secret kettle found and cleared. Story mount cleared. Yay! Super nice. I'm gonna. Boop. Just. Cool. Anyways, that's gonna be it for now. Next time on Splatoon 3. We will be tackling the, uh, the Splatfest that will happen on the 12th, so it will be after the epilogue of Pokemon Scarlet and Violet is recorded and probably uploaded. So after the epilogue of that is done, we will do this. We will do the Splatfest, and then I will talk about how, what I will, how I will handle Splatoon 3 going forward, because uh, what's remaining in the game is multiplayer stuff and waiting for the DLC, but I do kind of want to, we'll, we'll talk about this as we, uh, next time, well, after the Splatfest and everything, but yeah, that'll be it for now, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video, hope you have a good day.